so as you guys know, I love posting my PR hauls on TikTok, but I was in California for about a week. This is uh, what was here when I came home. And obviously it wouldn't fit in a 60 second TikTok. So I decided I'm gonna start bringing some of my hauls to YouTube. Now to speed up the process, I have undone a lot of the tapes and stickers and whatnot. And I literally don't even know where to start. Just kidding. I'm gonna start with this one. So up first we have this stunning like jewelry box. It's by the brand Kaleidos. Uh, that's how you spell it. And I love a good creative PR package. Each one of these drawers is filled with something absolutely magical. And I'll be honest, this is a brand I've never heard of, but I am already sold because the packaging is so luxe. It's like tin or metal or whatever the heck that material is. But I think this is some sort of, <gasps> come on, come on, this is so cute. So when you get closer, this is what it looks like. And I'm thinking this is like maybe a liquid lipstick of some sort. Oh my gosh, it is. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Then we have a cutie little blush brush, which I love a good blush brush. Guys, the packaging for this brand, look at this eyeshadow palette. First of all, colors, stunning, huge mirror, but look how like luxe this is. We have a second eyeshadow palette. Oh, okay. Honestly, like gray and blue eyeshadows are so underrated. I think they can look so cool. Okay, now we're on to our very first drawer. And it's filled with some of, again, guys, the packaging. These are some of the most beautiful blushes I have ever seen. We got a little neutral number. Oh, I love a coral. I love a coral. Also, um, if you're wondering why I look like I just got hit by a bus, um, I've been wanting to do this haul since I got back like two days ago. And so the second I woke up, I threw on the sweatshirt and I started filming. So go ahead and just disregard that. Now let's go on to our third and final drawer. So it looks like the first thing is a cutie little lip treatment. Aw, it's their coconut oil lip treatment. That sounds like a dream. And then two more blushes. An even brighter peach. <gasps> Stop. Look. Okay, look at this pink. I love a pink. Next, we're going to move on to this cutie package from LA Girl. Guys, what? This is like summer in a box. Uh, I need to show you guys these highlighters right now. Look how big this packaging is compared to my face. Slay. We have some like long wear eyeshadow sticks and then a cutie little palette. <gasps> that color range. Slay. Next, we're going to move on to this cutie little tiny box. This is from DP Hue and it's their apple cider vinegar scalp serum. Has anyone ever used a scalp serum? I'm a little bit nervous just because I typically have pretty dry hair. And so my hair doesn't really get oily, so I don't want it to get oily if I use a serum. But what's the tea on those? Next, this is from the brand, oops, Crush XO. Guys, you don't even know how much I love receiving brushes because for me, brushes aren't like a fun thing to buy. So when I don't have to pay for them, it, it's a dream come true. Other than the brushes, I have this cutie little container that kind of reminds me of the like Glossier bags that you get. And it comes with a Gems lip gloss. Love that. A liquid lip. Okay, some people say a liquid lipstick is like 2 2016, but I don't care. I absolutely love them. Um, this is a eyeshadow palette, another lip gloss, and then we have a highlighter and a blush palette, which honestly, these are my favorite for like traveling because you don't want to bring a ton of different products. So you just bring a palette. Okay, next, I'm just going to go ahead and I'm going to skip to this one because... I've been dying to open this one. I got the new Rare Beauty, like, complete lip liner and lipstick little thing, and I could be more excited. My friend Ablin um, also got this PR package, so when I was in California, I got a little sneak peek, and I can already tell you that I'm absolutely obsessed with the shade Humble. <gasps> okay, I'm definitely gonna be filming a TikTok on this, I promise you. Okay, next, I have a tinier package from Tarte. Guys, the workers at Tarte, I don't know if they're like all angels or what it is, but they are some of the sweetest people. Stop. <laughs> a cutie little Starbucks gift card. Oh my gosh, that's so nice. I love Starbies. And then we have their new fake awake little like eyeliner pencil. That's, you can be, you can use it to like clean up your brows. You can use it on your waterline. You can use it to clean up your lipstick. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Stop it right now. I have another package from Tarte. They'd be spoiling me over there. 
Oh, okay. Okay, there's a lot of good things in this package. Starting with this workout set. Oh my gosh. They know me way too well. It's a cutie little sports bra and biker short set. Those look so nice. And then we have their new um, like shimmery bronzer and then maracuja, what is this? It's like their maracuja new glow stick. And I'm so excited because I love their like um, juicy lips or lip juices or whatever they're called. And now there's one for the face. Every time I think of the brand Tarte, I think of the trip they took me on and I'm still just like this. Like what a generous brand. I love them. Okay, next we have something from the brand Wild Hearts Skin. Um, this is another brand I've never heard of, but this box seems kind of heavy. What do we got? Oh, stop. Wait, they drew a photo of me. Oh, oh my gosh, you guys, a handwritten card. I literally need to like cut the clip here because I'll literally start crying. Oh, oh my gosh. Okay, and then inside of the box, there's actually some like really fun looking skincare. We have a exfoliating serum. We have a marshmallow glow cream. What is this? Oh my gosh, a papaya niacinamide and hyaluronic acid serum. I ran out of my hyaluronic acid yesterday. Um, a raspberry and marshmallow toner. What? A raspberry and marshmallow foam wash. That must be like their signature, I'm assuming. And then their scrub off papaya cleanser and their marshmallow overnight mask. That's so cute. Okay, next, let's go into most makeup. I'm not gonna lie, I've opened this package and I've seen it and I literally screamed. Um, other than handwritten notes, my next favorite thing to get <gasps> is merch. In like all of my videos, I struggle to dress up. So I wear tees. So look, I have this one that says milk makeup. The back literally is awesome. And then look at this cutie little hoodie. If I'm not wearing a t-shirt, I'm wearing a hoodie. And look at this one. Oh, oh, I'm gonna be an edgy queen in this. And it's looking like those hoodies and like sure is a collab with Joe Perez. I'm gonna assume he did like all the designing and whatnot. How cool. Okay, next I have a package from Michelle Marie PR. I actually have a friend who works there, so it's kind of iconic. I wonder if she wrote me this note. Um, but we have a leave-in conditioner and then a flower fragrance for your hair. Oh my gosh, that smells nice. Okay, that's kind of cool. Okay, next we have a little box from Dr. Dennis Gross. I think another package just arrived. Let me go get it. Guys, stop it right now. It's another box from Tarte. Dude, why are those people so nice there? Okay, should we take a guess as to what it is? I don't know. I've, I'm trying to think of if they've launched any newer products that I don't know about. Oops. So, oh, was I not just talking about their Maracuja lip plums? And I got two of them. We have the shade White Peach, which is actually my favorite shade, and Tulip. They're so nice. Okay, anyways. These are the Dr. Dennis Gross Ultra Gentle Daily Peels. Um, the word peel scares me a little bit, but I've heard amazing things about these. So if you have tried these, please let me know what you think and how you like go about using them. And if you think they're sensitive skin friendly. This is the Ultra, Ultra Gentle formula. So I'm assuming it's gonna be great for me, but I'm still a little scared. Guys, next, fun fact about me, one of my favorite brands at Sephora is Ilia. Actually, I need to show you my favorite makeup product ever of all time is the Ilia Super Serum Skin Tint SPF 40. If you have dry, sensitive skin, this product will change your life. I promise you. And look. What? Okay, two more of those skin tints. Thank you very much. A multi-stick. We've got some eye tints. We have a mascara. We have a, con oh my gosh, I've actually been wanting to try their concealer so bad. And a ton of different like gel eyeliners and things. Should I film a TikTok on that stuff? Oh my gosh, I'm actually so excited about that. Up next, this is from Coco and Eve. Okay, I've actually heard fabulous things from them. <gasps> a 
Okay, we have two of their bronzing foams in ultra dark. I'm an ultra dark tanning girly because I'm so fair. If I use like a light shade, a medium shade, or a dark shade, you can't really like notice a difference. So I love doing ultra dark. We have two of those. We have some of their face drops, Slay. Um, on the topic of like self tanners, guys, the brand Australian Glow, let me get it, hold on. I need to show you. Okay, this product has also changed my life. It's by Australian Glow, like I said, and it's their ultra fine facial bronzing mist with rose water. So before bed, I just go all over my face and it gives you, actually I have it on right now, it gives you the most stunning glow like ever. And it doesn't break me out or anything. So I love it. It smells very fake tanny, but I don't care. As long as I look good in the morning, I'm fine with it. Okay, sorry, I got a little sidetracked. I just needed to show you guys. Um, but then we have their exfoliating mitt. Oh, we have a tanning face brush. I've actually never used a face brush. We have another tanning mitt and then a velvet self tan back applicator. Oh my gosh, that's so convenient. Okay, two more boxes. Which one should I do? Let's do this one. This is by Murad. It's their deep relief acne treatment. Oh, it's so cutie. Oh my gosh, there's more merch in here. Uh, stickers, slay. What should I put those on? A hair clip. Let me put my hair in this right now. I'm actually hot as can be because I'm wearing this super mega heavy um, sweater from the Mayfair group. I actually love it, but it do be hot. Um, so now I have a new t-shirt to switch into. What does it say? It says, hashtag free the pimple, but don't squeeze me. <laughs> All right, love that. And the color, so cute. And last but not least, Drunk Elephant. That's another brand that just treats me so well. And their boxes, adorable, love. We have their uh, polypeptide cream. I've heard amazing things about that. And then we have their Proteiny Power Peptide Resurfacing Serum. Slay. Oh my gosh, I'm literally so excited. Okay, I also did a little damage at Sephora, but I think I'm going to film this one for TikTok. So if you're interested in that, check out my TikTok page. I'll probably be posting it sometimes this week. Oh my gosh, thank you guys so much for watching. And if for some reason you're a brand who sent me one of these items, literally, I love you so much. You've changed my life. Um, also, let me know if you like these longer hauls on YouTube or if I should just stick to TikTok because I'm fine either way. As long as I get to film it, I'm chilling. Um, but yeah, I love you guys so much. Bye.